Hi, this is Toby Radloff, the genuine nerd from Cleveland, Ohio. And tonight I'd like to talk about exercising and exercise devices. As you may know, everybody's on a health kick these days, including us nerds. We'd love to look good on the beach, so we'd have to cut back on our Twinkies and our White Castle hamburgers. But in order to attract the mega broads, we have to learn how to get some of this excess poundage taken care of. So that's why I'm going to talk about exercising and exercise devices tonight. And what I have in front of me is one of the great grand pops of exercise devices that have been promoted on television over the years. This is called a twist the health twist board. These have been like promoted on late night television in the early 1960s, you know, about the time that Chubby Checker came out with his record, The Twist. My mother used to have one of these. And how it works is you put it on the floor, and just like it says on it, you do the twist in order to try to get rid of some of these excess pounds. Perhaps Chubby Checker had one of these things too, because he's not chubby anymore. And it's basically how this thing works. And what I have here now is what they call a gut buster. It's one of the exercise devices that have been popular on television over the last few years. I remember that when these were first advertised on TV, they were selling for $19.95. This particular model I bought up at Bernie Shulman's for $3, which makes you wonder after somebody pays $19.95 for something, they're going to kick themselves in the butt only because they found the thing locally for much less. How this thing works is you sit down, slip this over your feet. These are like foot, you know, for your feet. And then it has like a high pressure spring and a handlebar. And all you do is like pull up, pull back, pull back, pull up. Basically you do sit-ups with it and it's supposed to help your abdominal muscles firm up, unlike doing regular sit-ups because this thing sort of like holds your feet in place rather than if you're doing it without it sometimes your feet might move all over and also take some of the stress and some of the pain out of doing sit-ups because this keeps your body straight while you're doing it Buster. And you can't see it now, but what I'm on is what they call the miracle exercise device of the 90s. They call it the abdominizer. It's like a plastic shell that's shaped to conform your butt. And there's handles on the side of it to enable you to do sit-ups. This is how it works. <sighs> And as you may know, after a few minutes of working out on these miracle exercise devices, I'm already starting to feel the effects of being slim and trim. My stomach and abdominal muscles are already starting to tighten. Imagine if I'm to work out a few minutes a day on these devices, most likely somebody will mistake me for Arnold Schwarzenegger. So in order to attract the mega babes on the beach, I'm going to have to do this every single day for a few minutes. Because regardless of whether you're a nerd or not, if you want to look good, you better shape up or ship out. And this is Toby Radloff, the new and improved, slim and trim, genuine nerd from Cleveland, Ohio, reporting exclusively for the Eddie Marshall Show.
Ah, whoa, is that big?